What if we told you there was a way to cut down paying interest on your mortgage using this handy tip? This is how one of our clients is going to save up to £84,000 in interest. We're going to run through a quick example of how they're going to do that. But first of all, let me explain what we're talking about. So we're talking about overpayments. This is where, say for example, you have your standard monthly mortgage payment and you would choose then to pay an additional small amount over and above what your mortgage payment is. This is called an overpayment. Now, most owners allow an overpayment of up to 10% of your mortgage amount per year. So let's say, for example, you had a mortgage of, say, for example, £200,000. They allow you to make a further £20,000 extra in voluntary contributions, which is 10% of your outstanding balance per year. Now, this is the maximum they set. After that, you can still make overpayments, potentially on some mortgages, but you might have to pay some early repayment charges. So the majority of lenders are going to allow you to have 10% as an over additional payment per year without paying any interest at all. And of course, the more of a payment you make, the shorter your mortgage is, which means the less interest you're going to basically pay. So an example here, we had a client uh, who was looking to take out a £200,000 mortgage over 35 years. In this example, we can assume an interest rate of 5%. So the payments work out just over £1,000 per month. So they work out £1,010 per month. The client's looking to pay an additional £50 per week, which we averaged out, say, £200 per month. And that basically means that they've chosen to make that overpayment. This is going to reduce their mortgage term by 11 years and 7 months and save them £84,000 in interest, which is absolutely fantastic. It is also quite flexible as well. So the minimum you have to pay your lender is £1,010 per month. The overpayment is completely your choice. So if you set that up as a direct debit or a standing order for, from the lender, um, you chose to pay this extra £200 or you chose to transfer it ad hoc every single month, you can always stop that overpayment or reduce that overpayment and just drop back down again to your £1,000 a month should stuff get tight, should you have an emergency or anything like that. So making an overpayment is a really, really good way of being slightly flexible but also cutting down your mortgage term. If you want any more useful info on mortgages, please like and subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell button for latest notifications.